everyone, generating the right content in WordPress and ensuring that it ranks is quite hard. But here's a solution to that. We all know about Rank Math SEO. But here's the catch. Rank Math SEO has launched its latest feature, Content AI, that will help you generate SEO-friendly content using AI and will ensure that it ranks well. Thus, in this video, I'll give you a quick walkthrough of Rank Math SEO's latest Content AI feature. I'm Aparna Singh from LearnWoo and let's get started. Now, Rank Math SEO's new Content AI has powerful and easy to use features that help you do better in SEO, whether you are new or experienced in it. Now it offers around 40 plus AI tools for every requirement making it a versatile choice for your content and SEO management. Now let's take a look at how this content AI actually works. For that, let's first install Rank Math SEO plugin. For that, go to WordPress dashboard, plugins, add new. Now here on the search bar, search Rank Math SEO. Once the plugin appears, click install. And once installed, click Activate. Next, we need to enable Content AI. For that, go to WordPress dashboard, Rank Math SEO. And you'll be landed on this particular page and you'll be asked to connect your Rank Math SEO's account. Now click on Connect Now and enter your credentials and connect to your account. Once you've connected your account, you'll land on the dashboard of Rank Math SEO in WordPress. Now scroll down and enable this particular button to activate the Content AI feature. Now first let's make a few settings. For that go to WordPress dashboard, Rank Math SEO. Now click on General Settings. Now here from the left column, click on Content AI at the bottom. Now here you first have to select the default country, which basically will be the target country from which the keyword suggestions are taken. Now choose any particular country if you want, else choose the option worldwide, which I think is a better option in case you have topic that is for the entire world and you're looking for a better reach. Next from the default tone, select the tone of your content from the drop down. Now you'll get various options like formal, casual, factual, technical, etc. Select the one that suits your content best. Next, from the default audience option, select the audience that you would want to read your content. Now, select the suitable audience from the drop down here. You'll get plenty of options like gamers, bloggers, writers, general audience, etc. Now, I would suggest you to keep it general if you don't have any niche mentioned here. Next, from the default language, select the language in which you want the AI generated content to be in. Like here, I have selected US English. Next from this button here in front of enable Grammarly, select it to fix grammatical errors on the fly while content is being generated or written. Next in the select post type option, select all post pages and products so that you get to use content AI in all these places. And once you are done with all these changes, select save changes. However, please note that you can also reset the options from the reset option given here. Now, since the required settings for Content AI are done, let me quickly show you how it works. For that, go to WordPress dashboard, Rank Math SEO. Now, click on Content AI. Here, you'll get all the Content AI tools like Blog Post Idea, Blog Post Outline, Blog Post Introduction, Post Title, Topic Research, SEO Title, SEO Description, etc. Now, if you're looking for a particular tool, you can search from the search bar here as well and select its category. You can choose your required AI tool, answer the ask settings and generate the content. Now, once it's generated, you can use it in respective places, be it in WordPress itself or outside. Next, let's generate an entire content post using the content editor option given here. For that, go to content editor option from here. Now here you can generate content using different content AI tools. Let's first add a topic. For that, enter double slash and you'll get all the AI tool options. Now select post title here. Now here you'll get the post title tab. Enter the post brief here. Next here, select the audience. 
and from here select the tone of the content. Now I'll keep it formal. Next from here select the style of the post title. Now you'll get plenty of options here. However, I have selected storytelling and opinion. Next select the length of the post title. Now I like to keep the titles short so I'll select short here. Next select the output language from here. Here I've selected US English. Next from here select the number of outputs that you want and then click on generate. Now you'll get a few titles according to the output selected. Now from here you can either copy it or insert it directly to the post. I'll select insert. Now here the post title is inserted. I'll put this title to the heading block. Next let's generate the content. For that simply go to the right panel here. Click on AI tools and select the tool of your choice. Now you can search the AI tool of your choice from the search option here. Next here I'll choose blog post outline. Once the tab opens, give the topic here. Here enter the main points and ideas that you want to cover. Next select the audience from here. Now enter focus keywords if any. Next select the content tone. Now from here select the style of the content and lastly select the language from here. Once done click on generate. And in no time the blog outline will be generated. Once it's generated either click on insert or copy it. Here I've inserted. Similarly generate intro to the post using the blog post introduction option from here. Now give the post title here. Select the audience. Select the tone and style. And once all that is done click on generate. Now here you'll get a few introduction suggestions. Now that is in case you have increased the output. Now use the one that you like and insert it. Similarly generate blog conclusion from the blog conclusion option here. Once the tab opens enter the topic. Write the main take of the post here. Now select a call to action from here or enter a custom one. Just like other tools select the tone, audience and language of the conclusion too. Here I'll suggest that you should keep the output at least 5 so that you have more options. And once done, click on generate. Now select the one that suits your requirement and click insert. Next if you want to generate content for each of these outline points, simply select paragraph option from here. Now once the tab opens in the main argument box, enter the outline point. Make other selections as required. Now select the output number here. I would suggest you to keep it 5 and once done click on generate. Now it will generate few options according to the output selected. Select the idle one and insert it to the blog post from the insert option here. Follow the same process to add content to every point. Once your entire content is ready, either copy it as text or block from the option here on top. Now that is if you want to use the content elsewhere. However, once the content is ready and you want to post it here on WordPress, simply click on create new post. Now the editing page of the post will open and the content has been copied here. Now make any changes if required. And then once done, publish it from the publish option here. Now that was how you can generate content using Rank Math SEO's new content AI feature. 
Next, let me show you how you can also edit already published posts and improve SEO using this feature. For that, go to WordPress dashboard, posts, all posts. Now from here, select the post that you want to edit and click on edit. Now here in the right panel, click on AI content symbol given here. Now here you can use this area to get an SEO plan using the content AI. Now let's write two to three words related to your post and see what the SEO result of your post is. Once your content AI score is generated, here you can see the score, word count, link count, heading count and media count. Now every count that has a green dot stands at a good place but those that have a red dot lacks SEO and should be improved. To improve that, you can simply click on AI tools option given here. Now let's create a SEO title since that was lacking. For that, click on SEO title, enter the current post title here. Next enter and select other fields if required. Now select the output number here and once done, click on generate. Now choose any one of the titles suggested. Choose the one that you like. Copy it and replace your previous title with the new one. Similarly, you can add frequently asked questions from the option given here as this is a great way to engage your audience. Similarly, you can play around here with different AI tools given and improve your post SEO. Now that was if you are writing blog posts, but if you are a WooCommerce store owner, then this particular new feature of Rank Math SEO helps you to improve content generation and SEO of your products as well. For that, go to WordPress dashboard, products, all products. Now click edit on the product in which you want to use the content AI. Now here in the right panel, you can see an option content AI. Similar to how we use it for post, you get all the AI tools if you click here. Now Content AI offers tools specifically for content of product. Like let's add a better product description. So select that particular tool that is given here. Now once the tab opens here, enter the product name. Give the features and benefits of the product here. Next choose your audience. Now give any main focus keywords here. Next, select the tone of the content. Now, select the language from the option here. Here, select the number of output that you want. And once done, click generate. Once the description is generated, simply click on insert. And the new description will be inserted. Follow the same process to use other tools and edit your product's content using AI. Now, you get different AI tools for products such as product pros and cons, product reviews, product description, hero, etc. And that's all. This was all about Rank Math SEO's latest content AI feature. Hope you found this video to be helpful. And if you like this video, give a big thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more videos like this. And don't forget to hit the bell icon to keep getting updates on more such videos. Thank you so much for watching. I'll be signing off and we'll see you in the next video.